Hey YouTube, Edward Tindall here. My grandma's plants growing. But uh, that's what not, not what today's video is about. Um, started the fence here. New fence. This su newly subdivided property. And uh, we're going to talk about frogs today. Our frog breeder tank. Mm, everything spring happening. But the salty oak. It's amazing. Um, here's the pond. So far, what it looks like the frog pond. We have about 50 either spring or leopard frogs or something my brother was catching. I thought was bullfrogs originally, but I don't think they are now. I think they're a smaller species. Um, I'm looking at these things, I want to show y'all something. I'm gonna go through here. So I can see there used to be some frogs in here. In between these little crevices you'll find green tree frogs that I've been raising here for about seven and a half to eight years. See in there or not? On this other side. There you go. Can you see in there? You see in there? There's a green tree frog in there, though. I'm gonna stick in there and get him out. And there he is. picking up on the camera or not he's there anyway well look at that wasp trying to sting the hell out of me you see that look how close look how lucky that was can y'all see this you see that if I can touch him whoa 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 yeah, I'm a little guinea wasp. I don't, I'm not too fond of those. Um, I'm sure that one's not too fond of me. Now it got mashed there. Um, so we breed these green tree frogs. I set up little pans like this around the edges of the pond so I can be able to collect their eggs, and they will decide to go in the shallow water and have tadpoles. I don't know if y'all can see or not. There's a lot of them in here. Now look. You can see. Little tadpoles everywhere. Millions of them. And then I raise these up to full grown adults. And uh they're adults. There's still some eggs in here. Let me see how little these are. I'm trying to get one so y'all can actually see it. There's one little tadpole. Look how little that is. One little green tree frog. Is that amazing or what? So these will grow to adults and then uh after they're adults, I sell them for three dollars a piece. A lot of three dollar bills here. Look at all these on this rock. Look at all them dead bulls on that rock right there. How freaking cool is that? We raise many species of frogs, and I've been doing so for many years. Those are amazing. You can set up a uh, I tell people when they buy these frogs, they, these frogs do have a loud croak. So if you like frogs that make sounds, this is definitely one that makes sounds. And if you got a bunch of them, they sing. Which I personally like going to sleep to the sound of uh, these frogs and rain, thunder. It's really a nice, uh, nice way to sleep. 
Hey buddy, what you doing? What you doing? What you face? Everybody come to see me. Hey little buddy. Hey, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Oh. Oh, little baby. He's your little cute baby, blue-eyed beauty. Yes, he is. Oh. Oh. You're such a sweetheart. Yes, you are, darling. Yes. I love pet, I love pet goats. They're so cool. Look how fat he is. This little shit. He did something. Yes, he was. He was something. Yep. Um. So you get tadpoles, and then they'll live their life out and hatch and be little green trees. Frogs. Wish I had multiple, multiple uh, things to show you all, but stages of life. But I don't, unfortunately. <sighs> the plants are growing. Everything's going. So in here is the the bigger frogs and the oxalotls. For now, and the green tree frogs. I also have another tank with my goldfish. Um, you can get ducks and stuff all over. You got several little tanks going. There may be some random tadpoles in here. And here. And here. Definitely green tree frog in here. This is where I originally started raising green tree frogs. There's a goldfish right there. Yeah, goldfish. Don't really want somewhere. This is my harvesting pond for harvesting. Uh, hey, look at all the goldfish in there. We got about a thousand in there. And this is a separator tank. This has got something in it. Oh, I'm pissing that chicken off. Oh, what the hell we here? We got a lot of diggers. Look at these diggers. Digger chickens. See a goat over there. This is another tank for holding stuff. Oh, I'm gonna set up the greenhouse. I set this up originally for Sarah. I'm sorry. Get pissed. I set this up for Sarah uh, and all of that, but it's fell down. I'm gonna reset that up and grow. There's my other old fog filter. Got messed up somehow. Or another. Well, anyway. What is that? Ducks are doing good. Um. Chickens like dusting. There, there's my old hen. She's about 10 years old. Me and Sarah hatched her out. Well, got some fruit trees going. Pineapple. Little panda over there. Look at that pan pan. Yep. Hope y'all like the update on everything. Got these tadpoles over here. I'm gonna put this greenhouse over here so we can uh, grow different foods and stuff. Well, there's tadpoles. That big tadpole right there. Big difference between the green tree frog tadpoles and, well, you can flee the coop. Big difference in green tree frog tadpoles and bullfrog tadpoles for sure. A little turtle. Um, got this thing growing. Look at all this new growth. Oh, new growth. This thing is beautiful. We got some red mangoes here growing. Oh, little puppy dog. That was a little baby foxy. A little baby Anansi. And a little baby Anansi. And a foxy. Look at that, how that turned out. Foxy, brown, Tyndall, a Nancy, spider god Tyndall, a Nancy baby, and a Foxy baby. They look just like their mama and their daddy. Two little girls. They're so sweet and precious. Yes, they are. Oh, Foxy, you had some birdie babies, darling, darling. Oh, 
I got this little movable pin here set up for them. Yeah, I moved most of the blocks the other day. I still got this little piece of blocks left to go there. Everything's blooming. I gotta get this greenhouse done so I can get Sarah in and out so she can start enjoying plants and stuff. I'm gonna put her a bunch of orchids and stuff out there and have this thing in there. Look at that big, that big bullfrog tadpole over there. You can see he's fixing to come up to get some water or some air. They're growing. They're eating catfish food. Like it's nobody's business. Oh, they eat catfish food. I'll keep on feeding them that even until they're full, uh, full fledged adult. This cat just lays around in the shade, waiting for something, uh, waiting for something to be cooked on the old grill. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, I know it. I know it. Yes, daddy knows, daddy knows. Anyway, people, I'm not going to take up much more of your time. Just want to give you all a few updates. I know out.